What's cracking, lady fam? It's your boy Unk No Punk. Unk No Punk with another short one just for you. This is going to be about some goofy dude named Keefy D from the West Coast, right? I made a video about this dude. Not really about him, but it was somewhat about him. I said something about a couple weeks ago, right? This dude talked about how he was in a car with his nephew, Orlando Anderson, and them um, shot Tupac up, saying he was trying to, he was trying to climb into the back seat when the bullets hit him, right? He, like, talking like, yeah, 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 right? So like I said before, I thought this dude was in jail before, but I see he's free, right? And I was like, God damn, you know, where's the love at for Tupac? How's this dude just walking around and shit, you know? And nothing's not happening. You know, all this thug life shit that I told you before about all this thug life and no one's doing a goddamn thing to this dude. Like I said before, I want nothing to happen to him anyway. But like I said, it's none of my business, but just to see this shit going on. Plus, this dude's now coming out on um, the ex-cop. The ex-cop, the dude that um just got came out of um a federal camp. You know, Reggie Wright. You know, Reggie Wright, I like Reggie, because Reggie, you can look at him, he tells the truth. You know, all his stories, everything he talks about is like on point, you know. Everything he says is on point, right? But now you got this dude, Keith, he did this sloppy ass dude. Told me I act like he's so much whatever a gangster and he like he got power and shit like that. But he sit there lying on um Reggie Wright Jr. wife and all this shit there. So he was with her. Took her to two um fights in Vegas. Yeah, the homies was there too. You can look in this dude's eyes and see that he's lying. He's not a good liar. I'm saying I don't give a you get fuck with say this dude is not a good liar, right? He said also, um, Tupac knocked his um his nephew out. He's the only reason why Tupac dropped him is because um three weeks before that, Orlando got shot in the knees with an AK forty seven. He just started walking. So he's not saying if he was um without no shots in the knees that Pac couldn't drop him. This dude's a clown. <laughs> I swear this dude's a goddamn clown. Now I understand he won't try to speak up for his um his his dead nephew, you know what I'm saying? Try to speak up for him. But he's the same goddamn dude that snitched him and put the murder on his um his nephew. You know what I'm saying? He's he's dead, but he still put his name out there and snitched on him. You know what I'm saying? I ever heard that um Keefe D's sister, once he done snitched on Orlando, snitched on her son that she caught a stroke or some crazy wild shit. You know what I'm saying? They even say Keefe D cannot come back to Compton. I don't know about that shit. Anyone, anyone can come back any goddamn way. We see how Takashi 6 9 just fucking snitching through all these motherfuckers in goddamn prison and still fucking doing his thing. So I'm, I don't really believe that shit there. But this dude, he's a real liar, though. Just look at him like he's, he's a real character. You know what I'm saying? Reggie Rice said, dude, there ain't no goddamn gangster. He's, no, he's a clucker. You know what I'm saying? He was a crackhead. That's what he was. <laughs> you know, he says that shit. I'm, the way he talk about, I believe that shit, right? So when they asked Keefe D about um, Reggie Wright allegations, saying he's a crackhead, he did say yes or no. He's, oh, uh, he, 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 he's stupid. He's stupid. He, he more dumb than a bag of rocks. Uh, uh, Re Reggie don't know nothing. Reggie a cop trying to be a gangster. Uh, he didn't answer the goddamn question. But you can see this goddamn face that, um, Man, it's the truth. I ain't saying nothing wrong. Do what you got to do. You got to do You're going to shoot niggas in your goddamn arms. You fuck, what the fuck you doing? But I'm just saying this. He just see this dude talk. Ah, uh, man, he's a real character. He's a real character. And I said, I, for him to get out of stuff there, he snitched on his own. What's that? His nephew? Maybe he snitched on some more goddamn people and saying to get his ass out of some kind of trouble. You know, if I'm going to do some shit like that there, yeah, I don't know. But like I said before, you was in the goddamn vehicle too when you, your supposed nephew shot Tupac up. You was in there too, so you're accessory to goddamn murder. Why the hell is dude not in prison? Someone please answer me that fucking question there. Please answer that question. Why is dude ain't doing no goddamn time? We sit there admitting inside fucking interviews. I was in the car. Orlando shot. Tupac was trying to climb to the back seat, trying to get away when the bullets lit him up. But he's still walking around. Still walking around. You no, know? like I said for where's the love at? Ain't no love in these streets, fam. Definitely not. So don't even fall for that bullshit. Most of my I love you. All these dudes out there talking about, yo, man, I love you, man, I love you, man. They don't fucking love you. Don't believe that shit. Your mother and father loves you. You know what I'm saying? Your family loves you. 
other than that, don't be going for that bullshit. I love you shit for some dude you just fucking met maybe a year ago or you yeah, met inside school or some shit, fam. And I'm out. Peace.